Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we have got this problem where x value is 7 minus 2 times square root of 77 and y value is 7 plus 2 times square root of 77. And now we are going to calculate the value of x times y power negative 1 plus y times x power negative 1 and then times x power negative 2 plus y power negative 2 and everything raised to the power negative 1. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this part first inside this parenthesis. And I have just copied down over here x time y power negative 1 plus y times x power negative 1 and let's go ahead and manipulate this one. So this could be written as x times and then y could be written as 1 over y according to this given fact plus likewise y times this could be written as x power negative 1 could be written as 1 over x or we can write this one as x over y plus y over x. Let's go ahead and add these two brackets by crisscross method. Let me show you. So x times x is going to give us x square and then I'm going to put down this plus sign and let's go the other way around. y times y is y square divided by in the denominator we got y times x I'm going to write down y x so thus our this part has simply fied to this one so thus I can write over here x time y power negative 1 plus y x power negative 1 has been simplified to this part which is x square plus y square divided by x y and here's our next step let's focus on this part now inside this parentheses and here I have just copied down over here x power negative 2 plus y power negative 2 let's go ahead and manipulate this one as well so x power negative 2 could be written as x power and 1 over x power 2 likewise y power negative 2 could be written as 1 over y power 2. Let's go ahead and add these two fractions by crisscross method once again. Let's do this one. So 1 times y square is going to give us y square and then I'm going to put down this plus sign and the other way around is going to give us x square divided by let's multiply these denominators that's going to give us x square times y square. So now this thing has simply simplified to this part. So I can simply write this left hand side x power negative 2 plus y power negative 2 turns out to be equal to y square plus x square divided by x square y square. Now let me go ahead and take power negative 1 on both sides. We did this one because this x power negative 2 plus y power negative 2 has this power negative 1. So the right hand side could simply become when we flip it over so this is going to become equal to x square y square divided by y square plus x square by using this rule and our left hand side is the same one x power negative 2 plus y power negative 2 power negative 1 and now as you can see we have simplified this part over here and likewise this part over here as well and now here is our next step let's go ahead and fill in the blanks now I'm going to replace this part 
by just simply this one. So let's do that one. I'm going to write down x square plus y square divided by x times y times and now I'm going to replace this one by this right hand side. So this could be written as x square y square divided by this one x square plus y square I can write as x square plus y square and here we can see that this x square plus y square cancels out with this x square plus y square and now we can write this x square y square as x times x times y times y divided by x y and we can see that this x cancels out with this 1x and y cancels out with 1y so we ended up with simply x times y but we know that this x value is 7 minus 2 times square root of 77 and y value is 7 plus 2 times square root of 77 so I'm going to replace them over here so we can write x time y equal to here this is going to be 7 minus 2 times square root of a 77 and then 7 plus 2 times square root of 77 and now let's go ahead and multiply these two right hand side binomials as we can see that this represents the product of the difference and the sum so therefore we are going to use this well known formula a minus b times a plus b equal to a square minus b square here i'm going to call this one as an a this is b once again this is a and this is a b so this could be easily written as 7 square minus 2 times square root of 77 and then square so 7 square is 49 minus 2 square becomes 4 and the square and square root they undo each other we ended up with 77 and here we simplified this one out so x times y turns out to be negative 259 so thus the answer to our this given problem turns out to be negative 259 and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye